How do you protect yourself from zina? The reality is number one, number one. Everyone listen to this. It's not what you think I'm going to say. Okay? Self-restraint. Restrain yourself. You can. Restrain yourself. I mean, I had a 14-year-old come to me not so long ago. How do I protect myself from zina? I want to get married. Come on, be a little bit realistic. You got to protect yourself. You restrain yourself. Sabr, sabr. Come on, your day will come. When we were young, we also used to look at the opposite sex sometimes and think, when will I ever get married? Today, mashallah, you know, we've got children of our own. Mashallah, I'm sitting on about eight children by the will of Allah. Mashallah. So, subhanallah, to be honest with you, you have to protect yourself. That's what sabr is all about. You reward. The reward you're going to get is for abstaining from prohibition. That's the reward. So not only your salah and your zakah, that's doing good deeds. But abstaining from bad is also a reward. So here's your opportunity. Stay back.